during an annual health check and vaccination. The vet saw the epilis on the left lower jaw and advised excision. However, the owner had to go to Myanmar and postpone the surgery till August. This is a be kind to pets veterinary educational videos sponsored by Toa Payo Vets. Epilis in dogs. What is an epilis? An epilis is a humorous growth of the gum. On 15 of August 2018, a dog, Japanese Spitz, 10 year old female, was sent in with the complaint of having gum tumor. This tumor was discovered on 25th of June 2018, but the surgery was postponed till August. Here is a footage of physical examination. Okay, I'm doing the video on this gum tumor. Uh, now open very nice, you can see. Now this this tumor has become reddish, inflamed due to friction with the upper canine tooth. So mm -hmm. if you don't remove it, it will become bigger and bigger because of the irritation. Okay. How was the dog now? From the upper left upper canine. How was the dog? The ten plus. Ten plus, yeah. Mm -hmm. Normally we we cut it out and then send for histology. Mm -hmm. Hopefully it's not cancerous. Huh? Okay. Okay. Treatment. This video contains surgical procedure. Viewer discretion is advised. The treatment is electrosurgery to remove the epilis. Firstly, the vet put her under sedation and gas anesthesia before the electro excision. After that, the vet used electro cauterizer to cut off the epilis. This is a picture after the surgery. No stitching is required in this case. Outcome After the surgery, the dog was feeling well. She went home at 5 p.m. on 16 of August 2018. Here is the footage. 16 of August 2018. This is an 8 year old female Japanese kids, which came in yesterday for lump removal on the left mandibular canine tooth. Mm. This, mm. this is a gum tumor, it's called it's called epilis and uh, and uh, it has grown bigger now. So is there another photo? This is before operation. This is before operation. Go back to the same same orientation is on the left. Now this after operation, go back to the same orientation which is uh, which is here. Just now was correct. Same as the first photo. Uh, uh, hmm? Hmm? Okay, so anyway, uh, enlarge it. So the lump has been removed. Is it the only one? No more, right? Yeah. Okay, now we go outside and see the dog. See the dog now. Hey, right, come. So this day two after operation, you have to open up. Tell the e collar. Tell the e collar so you can you can see the. Did he? We have to finish this case first, huh? You don't want to go and distract. Wait, I'm wait, I'm going to go. Okay, we see the, 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 the canine tooth, the lower one. Open the mouth a bit bigger to show that the lump has been removed. There's a small hole. Is, is there any stitching? Mm. Let's see. Open bigger a bit. Bigger. You stand the wrong side. You gotta stand this side. When you stand the wrong side, you can't open the mouth. Huh? Yesterday, the owner can open the mouth. Grip on top. Grip, grip. <coughs> grip the. Your head off uh, you can see 
the, the, the gum tumor has been removed almost. Almost uh, 80%, 100%. The owner does not want histology, so we won't know whether it's cancerous or not. So if it does not recur, then uh, if it does not recur, then it's not cancerous. Can I make the photo? I will stop now. Tips and advices. Firstly, please always bring your pets to do health check and dental check frequently. Next, please seek treatment as early as possible if you notice any epilis on your dog's gum. You have now come to the end of the video. Credits to the vets Dr. Singh and Dr. Daniel, as well as vet assistant Judy and Sue. For more information, feel free to contact us. If you have any questions, you can send us an email via judy at or visit our website at twapayowets.com. Thank you for watching.